You should think about this because you might need a job in a little bit once you spend all that money. You got it. You might need a job. Being matchmaker could work for you. So you do a good job you today. I haven't seen my new contract. I, I saw the it. I saw the house that you're renting. <laughs> I saw the house that you're renting. Oh, stop. When you bring sixty to seventy rental. million dollars a pop a, a show, well then guess what? You get the you get the little perks like that. The next fight's gonna bring ninety yeah. to one hundred million. You know what I mean? You get these little perks when you do this that. This guy, think, you, dude, you, I'm you not don't, you don't bring that. I know you how that works. You don't know you about that. what you got. You don't. I you know my numbers. I just you got a check for my Aldo fight last week. It was five years ago. Yeah. <laughs> you don't know what the <laughs> and you that's, got. And that's and you know what? No, I do know. I knew know that that's true. And that's not your money. I get in in a chunk. Yeah. Straight. Listen, the straight wire into my bank. The ones on the inside. You get your money. You get your money The outside. High you get heels, your money drip. The bow tie. You get you your money drip. You, you get your money drip to you Look, because your numbers are low. Listen, when my numbers are so listen, high. I well, I came in here and signed a little yoke and I went into my bank account and the full number was in there. The yeah. money wasn't dripped. Then that means That's that, how you do business. Yeah. You you get a paycheck six years down the line for the elder boy because the numbers aren't great. Rightfully so, your money should be dripped. Dude, you should only get your money when we feel like have, paying you. Let me tell you that's that's business. what really should happen. People have My numbers are so big, people, I walk in and get the money in people full. Have, people have you, I've made more money more in this money. last fight than your entire fighting career. Probably not, but let me say this. 100% I have. how much you brought 100%. in how much you keep at the end. I've, I, 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 I bring matter. it in and I, get, I take it as well. Don't you worry about yeah, that. I bet you take it. Don't that's you worry about that. I bet you take it. You take your time and dress up in high heels and bow ties. Okay. <laughs> I put on my flip flops and I know about business and you don't know. What are you talking about? Oh. What, what business? Your, your last fight bombed and you lost. Now let's talk about this. Last bombed and you lost. I came up in a weight just to fight you. I'm about let's 20 pounds it. smaller let's than you. Let's do it. Let's, let's do it. Let's do it. You know, you know that fight. You not know only that is fight Tom happen. not extinctive on the ground, there's another guy in this room who's not extinctive on the ground. Yeah. <laughs> Good thing you're a big guy and you got a punch. That's about it. Well, well, yeah, well, well ask Chad well, how he well. feels about it. Ask Chad how he feels yeah. about it. This is going way south. We got to make fights here. <laughs> Let's Chad, match me up with this Oh, you want to do you, that? I asked you to you match. I asked, I asked him long before the show. I said, uh, give me this Dana, in Dublin. Let me, he spoke hey, many times about my native Dana, country. Dana, I'll kill him hey, on home, home soil. Said this. In, hey, in, as a warm up for the hey, Aldo fight, I'd kill him. Hey, but they wouldn't do it. They you know, wouldn't sacrifice you know your old ass from They know why. I'm not scared of <laughs> Yeah, okay. I never said you were, but it's You're an right. easy fight for You're me. Right. I mean, I'm gonna make these Chad, you. How Chad excited are you about a fight? We Chad just signed the fight. fight. I, 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 you I, I, said it would never happen. I'm going to make these I, fights. Did you see you? I asked for this fight in Dublin. I asked for the fight in Dublin as a warm up for the Aldo fight. Look, Dana, tell him what I said. I, I said, I'm said. not doing this show. I'll tell you exactly tell what I said. I know. I'll he tell you exactly what I said. Listen, I'll him. tell you exactly what I said. Two days before this show, I said, I'm going home. I'm not doing this show. Nobody gives a about a show when the two people can't fight. I've got to sit here and be around him and I don't get to punch the head off him at the end of the show. That's it's a fair enough. He's on a loss and he's he's on his, on the slide and the fight means nothing. Yeah. But it's 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 still a fight that makes sense because the, 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 the Irish here, fans know him. You could bring him on. Exactly. You haven't fought Frank. Exactly. So in a nutshell, Frankie's Frank. a Frankie's a weaker <laughs> version of Chad. Listen, both of you. I've been doing this for a very long time. I know what I'm doing. 